Hey guys, Tattoo for you, Richard here. I'm um, going to do an unboxing. If you can kind of see, I've already opened it. Um, this is the second time I've done this video. Actually, maybe the third time because they keep showing up corrupt. I don't know what's going on. This phone is garbage. I need a new one. So, this is the Dice Head Games Mystery Box. Here's my invoice. Um, it's a $60 a month subscription or $60 a month period. And you get a box full of random goodies. So, um... I went ahead and subscribed to it just because, and I sell stuff on eBay to try to make a little extra money to, to keep it. So, But here's the first thing we got out of the box is a beveled base, 25 millimeter runic mountain from Secret Weapon. I really like their bases, man. They're pretty cool. I've got two others I haven't used. Oh, look, man. that's This is technically perfect for Space Wolves if you think about it because, look, there's little runes on the side of them. Oh, the, oh, look, there's runes on the actual bases themselves. I don't know if you can see that pretty good. Well, these are a lot cooler than I thought, man. Sweet. I was going to use them for my towel because I thought I could pull them off as swamp bases, but hey. Space Wolves, that'll work. Then I got a Battletech figure, the Dark Crow. I've played Battletech one time. A long time ago when I worked at the comic book shop, it was super fun. I really enjoyed it. Um, I didn't like some of the figures. I thought they were a, a little cheesy. Uh, a couple of them just looked like they just threw like rectangles and squares together and called it a mech. A little bit more thought would have been awesome. But, but this figure actually looks pretty cool. Let's see if I can get a good view on it. So the Dark Crow. Sorry. I've got another Ultramarine button. I probably have like seven of these. I don't I'm serious. I don't know why. It's like anything I order, they tend to throw these in there. Way to go, Betrayal of Calf. Give me all the stuff. I got a Vallejo Paint Blue Fluffa Uniform Gray. Or uniform. It's kind of a dark gray. a nice tone I might use that because uh all I have are pale grays so they're a little bit lighter and it'd be nice to have this darker one so I can do some good shading especially for some of the stuff I'm gonna do um, still have a video in the works coming up of doing some marble practice on some marble painting so we'll see oh drop zone commander I heard this game is really fun what is the UCM katana battle tanks well, I said battle tanks. I'm just assuming they're battle tanks. They look like a tank. So, these are pretty cool. I like that they're going resin with figures now. Resin or plastic. Metal, I just... I'll show everybody. Just pull the box off the table. And this is the kicker. Oh, space wolves wolves in with a big glowing face. Don't you love that, cameras? Adeptus Astartes, Space Wolves Wolfen. <laughs> One of my favorite of the Space Marine companies. That I, Space Wolves have always been my favorite because they're like Space Vikings. Way to go. Um, and I wasn't a fan of these figures, but uh, Cat over at uh, uh, Templar's Crusade 01. He did them, and he kind of tweaked their poses a lot. And it's this middle guy that I just, he's like, I'm going to jump and give you a hug. No. And uh, the way he did it looks more epic than this, and I like it a lot. So, so yeah. So this is my box. This is what I got. I got the Space Wolves, the Drop Zone Commander, the Battle Tech, which is open and stuff falling out. Hopefully nothing is missing. The Secret Met Weapon Miniatures. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. The Vallejo Paint and the button that I have too many buttons of. Um, yeah, so, I mean, this is $17 uh, Battletech Mini. When I worked at the comic book store 15 year, 10, 15 years ago, uh, Battletechs were usually around $8.50, 10 bucks. I'd probably say they're still about 10 bucks, so... 
27 on that. This is another 10 bucks for these. So that's 37. Um, last time I went to Hobby Lobby and picked up some paint. I want to say these are probably like six bucks, maybe eight bucks. I don't know. I can't remember. Button is free. So we got, I'd say a little over 40 bucks here. And this is definitely worth more than 20 bucks, man. Obviously, it's Games Workshop. This is probably five figures in a box. So they're probably selling it for 50 bucks. I, I don't know. I didn't even look at it because I don't play Space Wolves. Um, yeah. So, guys, check out Dicehead Miniatures for their uh, mystery box. It's pretty cool. I, by no means, am a, like, promoter of theirs. I just get it every month because it's cool, and I figure I'll share it, you know. Yeah. Uh, guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to do some other stuff this weekend. Hopefully, I'll get it uploaded. We'll see. If not, I will see you on Monday. Y'all cats rock. Enjoy the nerd life, my friends.